here it's just cloudy and temperatures in the mid to upper 70s. So some light showers still impacting north of Palm City, Port St. Lucie near I-95. Some light showers in Indian River County out towards Fort Drum and even Okeechobee. Just north of the city, we have a few pockets of light showers out there and a few more on the west side of Okeechobee County that will continue to track towards the northeast. Good news for your morning commutes for the Palm Beaches in Broward County. Things are dry, just very cloudy out there from Tequesta down into Fort Lauderdale. So right now we do have that low pressure system off the coast of Florida. Now again, it has a 20% chance for becoming something tropical within the next two to three days, even up to seven days. So we'll keep a close eye on that. All that moisture down south will continue to track towards the northeast. We have a stationary front that will just pull a lot of moisture from the Gulf of Mexico. So we'll see more rain and some strong thunderstorms again today. Widespread rains and a few thunderstorms in the early afternoon hours between 11 and 4 o'clock in the afternoon, mainly down into the Palm Beaches and Broward County. Also, Miami-Dade County could see the threat for flooding once again. They already seen up to 15 inches of rain just east of, of Miami. So tomorrow, we could see a quiet start, a couple of light showers in the forecast. Isolated thunderstorms will be in the forecast as well on Friday around 2, 3 o'clock in the afternoon. But notice less rain coverage in the next 24 hours. So we'll deal with widespread rains today. Localized flooding, an additional 1 to 3 inches of rain across the area, mainly across the Palm Beaches today. Isolated thunderstorms will be in the forecast and we could not rule out a quick tornado as well. Current temperatures in the mid to upper 70s across our viewing area. Hour by hour forecast will see those rain chances increasing by the hour and highs in the low to mid 80s today. Out in the waters, seas less than two feet looking good, but we are going to be dealing with lots of clouds and the widespread rains after 11 and 12 o'clock in the afternoon. Your seven day forecast impact weather until Saturday. Father's Day looks good, just a summer typical pattern. We'll see 30% chance for some inland thunderstorms in the forecast. Temperatures back up into the 90s. That means we'll see more sunshine over the weekend. Same thing on your Monday. We'll see some thunderstorms on Tuesday and Wednesday. Temperatures in the 90s again. Morning lows will be in the upper 70s. We'll see uh, more thunderstorms next Wednesday. A 40% coverage of rain with highs near.